Well, the, the thread, the thread that, uh, that winds through a, a, a rural ag community is, is so, it's so subtle, but yet it's very defined because uh, we're all dependent upon the land and we know we have to be good stewards of the land and my father was particularly, he was, um, you know, educator at heart you mentioned, but he really uh, was a historian also and he did a lot to uh, preserve, enhance, protect, and uh, also share the history of the Glades from the, from the settlements, from the, the different Indian cultures that were here to going back to the time when this area was uh, below sea level. He left a lot of, uh, a lot of legacy in his wake that uh, a lot of young people, farmers my age and younger, have benefited from. Now, I'm fortunate enough to have my son uh, involved, which is a priceless uh, part of, of our lives because uh, I'm, you know, teaching him, sharing him, sharing with him what I've learned. Uh, it's part of our succession plan. We would like to see the, uh, uh, the policy, the policy remain uh, as it is. We've, we've got uh, uh, a good stabilizing marketing presence, safety net, and it's extremely important that uh, it, it stays the way it's been. It's an economic anchor and it is the, uh, the stabilizer for uh, the economy. It uh, you know, provides a, a core base of jobs and then it is a key component of our whole crop rotation scenario.